the ZMN Diamond League certainly delivered some thrilling performances. It's exciting to see athletes from the Caribbean making significant impacts on such a global stage. From Mary Lady Paulino's comeback in the 400 meters to clock one of the fastest times of the season, to Jasmine Camacho Quinn's victory in the 100 meter hurdles, not only setting a new meeting record, but also a season's best time. The Diamond League season has made its return to the city of Xiamen, China. The Wonder Diamond League is the biggest forum for track and field athletes to earn points and cash throughout the season for the coveted championship final in Brussels. This year's edition of the Diamond League is the earliest that the season has begun, which made both athletes and fans excited. The city of Xiamen is often excited to see athletes compete, and this year's edition was no different. From a Caribbean perspective, the meet began with Jamaica's Christoph Bryan clearing the bar at 2.20 meters to play seventh in the high jump. The event was won by Shelby McEwen of the United States with a meeting record clearance of 2.27 meters. In the women's shot put, Jamaica's Daniel Thomas Dodd's effort of 18.76 meters in her second attempt could only manage her to get eighth in the event. Gong Lijiao of China was able to win the event in front of her home crowd with a meeting record throw of 19.72 meters. Double Diamond League champion Mary Lady Paulina of the Dominican Republic was able to return to her winning ways in her pet event, the 400 meters. She was up against her Caribbean counterpart Shade Williams of Barbados, who was a double world championship bronze medalist. Williams led the race to the 250 meter marker but Paulino was able to pass her and coasted to equal the third fastest time of the outdoor season with 50.08 seconds. Shade Williams was fourth with 51.97 seconds and Alia Abrams of Guyana was seventh with 52.69 seconds to rule out the Caribbean placings in the event. After Mary Lady Paulino's fantastic performance in the 400 meters, it was time for the 100 meter hurdles, which featured four out of the 10 athletes from the Caribbean. The 100 meter hurdles is arguably one of the most competitive events in track and field because the athletes are not afraid to meet each other. With it being such an unpredictable event, fans oftentimes do not have an idea as to which athlete will win. But on this day, the Olympic champion Jasmine Camacho Quinn of Puerto Rico prevailed when she was able to give her Caribbean counterpart Devin Charlton of the Bahamas a lot of pressure from start to finish. Jasmine Camacho Quinn crossed the line in a new meeting record and season's best of 12.45 seconds. Devin Charlton was in second with a season's best of 12.49 seconds. Danielle Williams of Jamaica in fourth with a season's best of 12.46 seconds. And her countrywoman Megan Tapper was eighth with a season's best of 12.88 seconds to end the race for the Caribbean. Anthony Strawn of the Bahamas was the lone Caribbean entrant in the women's 200 meters, and she ran a season's best of 24.21 seconds to finish ninth. The race was won by Tori Lewis of Australia with 22.96 seconds ahead of the 2023 Budapest World Championship 100 meters champion Shakari Richardson, who ran 22.99 seconds for second. 2020 Tokyo 110 meter hurdles Olympic champion Hansel Parchment of Jamaica ran a season's best of 13.33 seconds to finish sixth. His countryman Orlando Bennett ran a season's best of 13.58 seconds to place eighth. The 110 meter hurdles was won by 2023 Budapest World Championship bronze medalist Daniel Roberts with a world leading time of 13.11 seconds. To end the meet for the Caribbean, recently crowned World Indoor 60 meters bronze medalist Akeem Blake of Jamaica ran a season's best of 10.20 seconds to finish third in the 100 meters. His countryman Rowan Watson finished fourth with a season's best of 10.27 seconds, and 2011 Daegu World Champion Johan Blake ran a season's best of 10.43 seconds to finish ninth. The ZMN Diamond League has just added some excitement to the Olympic year, and the season should get even better. The Diamond League will remain in China, but the next time, it will be in Shanghai. What was your favorite performance from the ZMN Diamond League? Let us know what you think in the comments below. What performance from the ZMN Diamond League did you find most impressive? Did you think anyone can challenge Jasmine Camacho Quinn's dominance in the hurdles this season? Drop your thoughts and predictions in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Before you go, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification bell. Stay tuned as we gear up for the 2024 Paris Olympics, bringing you all the updates on Caribbean athletes. We are your one stop for everything Caribbean sports. This is Caribbean Focus Sports by Jairi.